Hi, and welcome back to my channel, Miss Damn Jewelry. I'm Dolores, and today I have Jessica with 50 Shutterbug, and we're going to go through a haul that I got on Facebook Marketplace. Ooh, and it was a lot of stuff, y'all. Let me tell you, I was so happy. Mm -hmm. Actually, I didn't even know about it, because I'm not on Facebook, because, <laughs> no. But you saw, you tell the story, girl, because you was there. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> Um, even though I'd already spent my budget this week of what I could spend for hauls, I, uh, was looking anyway, I can't mm. resist, you know, mm. window shopping. Oh. And I happened to see this, um, this lady had what she called a car boot haul. I think it was a moving sale based mm. on, you know, the fact that I got there and there was a sign about the house being sold and whatever long story, but I saw it. I was like, Oh, I really want that. But I've already spent my money this week. So I'm going to show Dolores because if I can't have it. Maybe Dolores wants it, mm -hmm. and you did, didn't you? Girl, she sent me those pictures. I was just like, like making them bigger on my phone. I was like, "Ooh, that's cute." Now, what I only the, there was only one thing that caught my eye, and I'll show you guys that in a minute. Mm. But when I saw all of it, I was like, "It was for thirty pounds for the whole thing." Now, when you see the pictures individually, you're like, "It's not that much stuff, really." Oh, <laughs> uh, it was. You went to go pick it up for me. Yeah, and I was like, oh no, I don't know how I'm going to fit all this in the car. <laughs> there was garden tools. Oh yeah. I mean, Matthew, forgot about them. There were garden tools, and I, the, my husband is going to use those for his garden. There was a quilt, uh, an afghan, yeah, a, a hand knitted afghan, and boxes and plastic boxes and bags, and she just kept bringing it in. I was like, girl. You can stop now. She's my, like, oh, no, my no. car was packed. <laughs> Even the front seat. She was like, she kept bringing it in. And I was like, oh, sweet Jesus. It's a lot of stuff. <laughs> so we're going to go through some of the stuff I got. And remember, I paid 30 pounds for everything. Yes. And I'm not even going to show you all of it because we'd be here all day. Oh, yeah. And I mm, don't got time for that. So what we're going to start with is, I think this, <laughs> this cake plate. And I don't, I'll say this watch, I don't see a maker's mark on it anywhere. But if you look at it from a distance, it looks blue. And I, it is blue. But yeah. if you look at it close, it looks strangely clear. I don't really understand why. But so it has that design on it. It has the leaves around the outside, and then roses in the middle. And I think that's quite old. It's very pretty. It is very pretty. And it's, you know, for cake plate or cupcakes. Mm -hmm. Oh, cupcakes would be nice on there. Definitely. Yeah. You could make a Sunday if you want. <laughs> anyway, so we got that. That's one thing. So that was a good, really cute bar bargain, I thought. Yeah, and it's satin glass on the bottom. Yeah, satin glass on the bottom. Sorry, I had to throw that in there because I like at the top is, is glossy and the bottom is satin. Yeah, so it's, I'll, I'll just oof, love that. So that'll be for sale in my Etsy shop, I think, or eBay. I'm not sure. I have to have decisions. Decisions, decisions. So the next thing I got was this little guy here. And he's like stone. Like a stone. Oh, is that stone? I don't know. Or is he wood? Is he wood? I think he's I, wood. I think he's wood. He's a wood owl. Very regal. Just, I mean, such a, I think it's from the 70s. Yeah, totally. Right? So when I got it and I looked at it, it's got an American price on the bottom. Love it. So where have they got it? They must have got it in the States. Must have. As a souvenir. Or Australia. They use dollars. Oh, yeah. They use dollars in Australia. Yeah. So yeah. maybe it's Australia dollars. But nonetheless, there's no damage to it. Just a really cute piece. A cute little owl. Love that. So, so pretty. And he's solid. Oh, he, yeah. You could hurt someone with this. I'll tell you what. <laughs> knock him right, right Remind out. Remind me not to tick you off. Knock him right out. So then the next thing I got was, oh, this. This is a whole tea set. And I was just like, oh. Yes. This Royal Albert tea set. You could see this in the pictures. Yeah, this you could see in the picture. This is was in the pictures that I could see. And it's got the maker's mark on it. I'll try to show you the maker's mark. So it's Royal Albert uh, Bone China. I love how she says that with that accent. Bone China. Bone China. Queen, it's called the Queen's Messenger. And it came with the cups. The saucers mm -hmm. and like the under oh it has an underplate for the teapot. I forget what they're called. Yeah. What they're there's a particular name, right? Um okay. Right? I could be wrong. Uh, the charger? Us, oh maybe the charger. Let us know in the comments what the underplate to the teapot is. We like, should really know this stuff. They're gonna be like underplate. Why are you asking? <laughs> so there's 
cups, teacups to it, saucers, plates. It's just, um, there's a five, it's a five piece uh, set with a five cups and saucers and plates. And I love this, this rose, like the pale pink color on there. Yeah, it's really pretty. And so that was in there. So that was a really, oof, I just, I, I just thought it was so, it was just so sweet. Do you know if you're going to sell it yet as a whole set or separate? I think it sells a set. I don't, I, I, I don't know. I, if I did, I would sell this with the underplate together mm -hmm. and then the cups together. And play. You know what I mean? Like as a separate lot. Yeah. Right. Okay. I got you. Two separate lots. Two separate lots. Sense. So I might do it that way. So that's going to be available soon. Decisions. Yeah. I, I don't even know. Do you know what that's from? No. The drag queen. Oh, no. What's her name? Decisions. Choices. Choices. That's choices. it. Choices. That's oh, I had it, it wrong. Yeah. Choices. <laughs> So uh, that's the choices I'm going to have to make. Um, so then, so these two items here, you have to hold one. Okay, I will do. I, I ain't holding them I'm up. nervous. So, I know. These two right here, Ooh. Jessica did look them up. I'm and, useful sometimes. And they're little ballerinas. And no chips, no cracks. They got all their fingers, all their toes. Their little headpiece is good. Just everything. And it's called, it's got a label and it's called Uniart. Let me see. I'll see try. if you can. How's that? There we so, go. And they're, they're, they're obviously a set of ballerinas. And you looked them up on your phone the other night when we when we first got these. You looked them up. Yeah. And how much did you say they sold for? Uh, Just over 35 pounds on auction. Which is not, I mean, that's a good price. For, these will pay for everything I just bought. Everything yes. after that will be profit. So gravy, that's pretty baby. Cool. Gravy, honey. Yes, with some biscuits. Ooh. Oh, mm. yeah. Jimmy Dean sausage. Okay, back to this. <laughs> so we're just so pleased with it. I just thought these were yeah. great. I, I, I they're really, I mean, even like her tiara or crown, well, even that's in good condition. Sometimes those bits of, I mean, the fingers, the fact that all the fingers, fingers are, are there. That's, yeah. Bonus. A oh, girl. Tink. <laughs> So these, these are very cute. That's going to be up and, oh, oh, we're up and running soon. I almost took the table out, y'all. It have been so good. <laughs> All of it crashed into the ground. Whoops. So the next thing I got was, in my lot, was this. Actually, this is, I think this is a tea caddy. Mm -hmm. It's all wood. It's got no maker's mark on it. And you have a set of two of them, right? There's two. I have two of these, exact same size, exact same they look exactly alike. So I'll be I'll putting coffee in mine. So yeah, they have the little, um, there's like a little metal flower on the lid. So that's, and then the plastic insert comes out and I'll show you. So you can, you know, keep everything fresh and there's no maker's mark on the bottom. That's just the bottom there. Still very retro though. So, yeah, I'd, I'd say they're seventies. Totally. Especially with the plastic, I think the plastic yeah. insert. So I really do like these. I just think they'd be cute in your kitchen. Yeah, if you're not into coffee or tea, you could put like crystal light in there. <laughs> crystal light. <laughs> Come on, we're gonna have a throwback. I mean, these right, are retro, yeah. so yeah, let's. Yeah, crystal light. My mom used to have that. Put a lot your Kool Aid packets in it. Just there in case. you go. Keep it fresh. <laughs> um, I don't drink tea or coffee myself, so these would just be decorative. Slim fast. Oh, I could put um, macar uh, macaroni. Not cooked. Oh, yeah. But like pasta. pasta. I don't put yeah. cooked macaroni in here and just eat it out of the pot. Can you imagine putting slim fast in there? Oh, my God. <laughs> Clearly, I don't use it. So I don't use it. Oh, it doesn't look very appetizing. No. <laughs> no. So, the next thing I got was, oh, y'all, this is so cute. It is very it's cute. It's called, it's for your mint sauce. And it's got a little underplate with it. And it is made by, here you read that. Ooh, it is made see. by. Uh, it's not completely pressed on. Yeah. It says made and decorated by Philip Loriston, England. Yeah. So, so I'll. So, something pottery. I can't read that. So it does have crazing in it because I imagine this is quite old. It must be. I think this is, and you can tell by looking at it, hand painted because it oh, has yeah. a little signature on the bottom of an S, a little um, initial, that is, of whoever painted it. But I love it with the crazing and everything. Yeah, this is super. You put your mint sauce in there. I, I mean... Does, I, that have, does that have the complete maker's mark on the bottom? You know how this one's stamped no, it's, on the it's, left hand? it's like... Whoever stamped it didn't press very well on the left hand side. Five seconds back in the day. But these are, this is really cute. It's all hand painted. 
yeah, little mint sauce on there. So that was a fun little find. I do like that. I mean, this would be cute even if you don't use mint sauce. And, you know, I don't. You can um, put a little succulent in there. Yeah, on your, in your kitchen. Yeah. On like your windowsill. Or toothpicks. You could put toothpicks in it too. Yeah, mm -hmm. that'd be really cute. So that was another cute find. And the next thing I got was, oh, look at this. This little brass bird. He's really cute. He's just, oh, he's just such a good, it's a brass. No, it actually looks silver. He's he's not pewter, is he? Maybe oh. sterling silver? I don't know. That would be cool. <laughs> he's, sorry, he's not a brass color. How he's, many he's Americans just... does it take to identify a metal? <laughs> More than two. Uh, so, <laughs> so uh, he's like a silver color. Sorry, he's not brass. He's a silver color bird. Just is hollow in the bottom. No maker's mark that I can see. Mm. And I just thought he's just a really, he's just so sweet and tweety yes. and little... And it's in really good shape, but I just think that was a fun little find there. The next thing I got is, oh, these. I'll show you these. Now this, come. this is one, this is a small bowl, and then she's got the bigger bowl there, and it came with four of these small bowls. So it's like a berry bowl, or, or maybe that has your, like. Could have, like, fruit salad in here. Fruit salad, and it's like your four dessert yeah. bowls. So, and that's like a transferware, and, and all the transferware on it is in really good condition. And, oh, very good. And it's got the yeah. gold accent around the top. It's just, yeah, it's not this, I don't up. think this has been used because it is not messed up at all. I see a little bit of wear from there. Oh, yeah, on the gold, yeah, that's just probably from handling it. But I, right. I mean, if they did use it, they took really, really good care of it. Yeah, because there's absolutely no scratches on the transfer. No, uh -uh. no, so. no. So it obviously did not run through a dishwasher, thank God. Oh, no. Cause, Could you imagine? Mm -mm, girl, I could not. So the next thing I got was this bowl, which again, it's like a transferware. But look at that. I don't know how I don't know how old it is, but look at the like the lace work around it. Oh, yes. Or the transferware. It is so pretty. It's in good condition. It just got a little scratch, few scratches on the bottom. Oh, it's from use, you know, or just but, from being moved from, around. Yeah, you know where you move it around. But I mean, nonetheless, wouldn't that be pretty on your wall or just? You know, with part of your display in the summertime with the little sunflowers. Oh, yeah. That'd be pretty. Yeah. So I got that, too. So that was a nice find. I'll just set that oh, okay. There. Set that there. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, don't, don't drop it off. So the next thing I got is these owl salt and pepper shakers. Aren't these so cute? They're, they're smallish, and there's no maker's mark on the bottom. But I just thought, oh, just adorable. Just a cute little set of salt and pepper shakers. I'll yeah, I think this lady that we bought it from, she must have really liked like owls and birds. Uh, yeah, because there was a couple of different birds and owls. In fact, I got a bird book that was kind of a vintage uh, bird book, uh, birds of British bird book. Of course, my husband's like, I'm keeping that. So oh yeah, he, like, he, he snatched it. it. He's like, nope. <laughs> I was like, but, and he was like, nope, that's mine. I was like, okay, you can have it. He deserves it. He does. I yeah. mean, he puts up with all, if I turned this camera around now, <laughs> there would be nothing but boxes. And so, what do you say? Say it out loud. Got creamware, is it? Them little white owls. Creamware? Creamware. Yeah, it's, it's a thing that... Oh, you, that's by Wedgwood. Yeah. The, Although it's not marked. I don't know. I'd have to, like, do some research on it. Yeah. That was my husband's voice, if you heard that inaudible Scottish speak. Um, he knows his stuff, too. He, well, he was he was there the first time it came out, so there you go, because he's old. So, <laughs> <laughs> so the next thing we got is, um, is this owl. So this owl is either a jam jar or it could be a sugar. Yeah, totally. It could be a mustard jar. And that's it there. So you can see it. And there is an embossed mark on here, but God, can we read it? No. No. Nope. We tried. Did we try? Yes. So, and that's got the little, where the spoon would go. So I'll show you the back of that. She says, I'll drop it now. Um, and I did, didn't come with a spoon, but again, I do have little spoons that when I go out, well, when I was going out, mm. and we go out and look for stuff. You know, when I was thrifting or anything, if I found little spoons, I snatched them up because, you know. I think you could sell it without a spoon. They probably don't need a spoon because he's cute. Yeah, he's mm. adorable. That's really fun. Now these, you have to get one of those. Okay. So these, we think they're a pair. And we'll show you why. 
Because the little wee hedgehogs. <laughs> oh my God, aren't they cute? Now Larry. they're not jam, uh, they're not jam jars. There's no spoon or anything. And I don't see. Does your soda maker's mark on it? No. No. Let me see. It looks like there was a sticker on there, but I think that was a price tag. Somebody's like selling it at like mm. a boot sale or something. Yeah. So these, um, this guy's got a little bit of cracks. Well, not cracks. Really crazing. Yeah. That's a piece of tape. That is. <laughs> he's okay. a really. He has less crazing for some reason. Yeah, he's got like a little tiny bit here. Well, other than yeah. that, he's. He's really other, I mean, inside so he's cute. in good condition. So we don't know if they're a pair, if they, you know. I think like I a think his and couple. her. A couple. Yeah. yeah, they're a couple. They're his and her or a his and his or. Her and her. Right. You know, we're not, we're open to it all. Yeah. So. Those they're so are, adorable. I just keep, I know I'm supposed to be showing them to the camera, but I keep, you keep looking, looking at them. At them like, oh, they're, they're just cute. adorable. So there you go. So that's that. The other thing I got. So I don't knock everything down. Or you want to hold one of these? Yeah, sure. So it was like a little set. I think it's a little sugar and a creamer set. And they're not that big. And they do have a marking on the bottom. I think it's on yours. Yeah. So let's see. Wood, swear, something. I forget now. Berry. So, so wood, swear, barrel, England. Oh, what a barrel. Okay, then. So... These, obviously, they're a set, but they're just, I mean, the color is everything. They're, like, very Art Deco style, I think. They are. I don't know how old they are, or... And that has the England on the bottom of it, just the England. Like a little imprint. Embossed, yeah. Yeah. On that. So, that was... Super cute. Oh, that was so cute. They're almost, like, Fiesta wear-ish. Oh, yeah, they are. Without yeah. being that bright color, there's, like, that muted, yep. like, blue color. Okay, so here's the... Here's what I saw when I saw the pictures. This is the only thing I focused on. <laughs> and I, I knew that when I sent the photos. I was like, she's totally going to gravitate towards this. This. This big boy here. It's, uh... I, <laughs> it's, it's blue, it's glass, it's cobalt. But it's massive. I don't know if you're getting the whole feel of it in the uh, camera there. But, um... It's got like the optic. It's like little. as tall as my forearm, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. <laughs> How many times have you been told that? <laughs> not many, I'm sure. <laughs> um, not many at all. So, this was what I saw. When I saw the pictures, I was like, I don't care what else is in there. The rest of it could be garbage. I want this. So, and the rest of it was not garbage, actually. No, really good. no. So, there's not a, the, the, there's a pontel mark on it, but it's not really rough, rough. It's, it's a little bit smooth now, but it's just, I mean, the shipping's going to be so fun doing shipping this, isn't it? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's going to be my wine glass. Oh, that's, oh, that's yeah. Kate's wine glass. I mean, you can put a lot of wine at the house. Or some scotch in there. <laughs> you put that much scotch in there, you just go into the grave. That's all you're going, that's the only place you're going to be after that. So, this was a really fun piece. I, I just, oh my God, y'all. I saw this and I didn't care whatever else was in that bundle. I, this, is what I, this is what she wanted right here. So, this is going to be for sale. And... I can ship it, yeah. That ain't gonna be you no problem. You can ship it, ship it. it'll that's be all right. Be fine. Yeah. I got a big boxes. So that was, that's what I actually saw. Lots of filling, picture. you know, bubble wrap. Fill the void, honey. Mm -hmm. So then I've got this as well. This is hand painted and it's like a white, it's got the gold rim around it. Don't sit right in my lap. <laughs> um, it's hand painted and it's got no maker's mark on it. But I just think it's a nice, you know, summer. I think it's a summery piece. Oh, yeah. Spring, summer, totally. I don't think you put your little yellow tulips in there. Your daisies. Or, okay, with we'll daisies. Yeah. Daisies and tulips. Gerber daisies. Gerber daisies. Show me daffodils. No, nothing. Daffodils are fine, sir. You can put your daffs in there. So, any, any, <laughs> it'd just be so pretty as a centerpiece on your kitchen table. Yes. Yeah, that'd be really pretty. So, that was a good find. So, that's. There's another one. So some really good stuff. I mean, I think like for, oh, this was a bargain. This this car boot lot. I mean, I still got stuff over there. Y'all ain't even seen. I mean, there's a whole bunch of stuff that I mean, I don't want to bore you. But then I got this is uh, this would be my last piece because this is gonna go on forever if we keep doing this. Um, <laughs> this is like just like a 
I guess like a water pitcher. I think it's a juice pitcher. I think it's a Kool-Aid pitcher. A Kool-Aid pitcher, yeah. So put about a cup of sugar in there, you're good to go. Um, oh, shake the table. Oh, oh my goodness. It's fine. Right. Nothing, nothing happened. It's all good here. Don't panic. Okay. So this has got like cut, it's like pressed glass or cut glass. I think it's pressed glass. Must be pressed Must glass. Be pressed yeah, glass. I can see the seam. Yeah. So it's pressed glass and it's got, it doesn't have a maker's mark on it. I'd say it was from the 60s or 70s. Maybe. I think earlier. You think I so? I think much earlier. Yeah. Okay. I think like Sour B or what is the other Ooh, one? Yeah. Starts with an H. We'll have to look it up. So that, I mean, it's heavy. She's got some heft to her. Yeah, for sure. It, it, I mean, again, I, I could take someone out with this. I mean, I wouldn't, but I could <laughs> if I was that way inclined, but I'm not. So yeah. don't make her mad. Don't, don't. No. No, I'm just kidding. So, She's got um, vintage glass. It's heavy. <laughs> vintage glass, and I'm willing to use it. Uh, so this is was a really nice piece. It's just a clear glass, and you know what would be pretty in it? If you didn't want to use it actually as, like, for a pitcher for your Kool-Aid. What's that? You could put, like, lights in it. You know, like, um, fairy lights in it. And just send it out with fairy lights. Mm. Ooh. And you could change the fairy lights to the color of the season. Oh, yeah. So you could have like green for St. Patrick's Day, red for Christmas, like orange for autumn. For Christmas, you could put some baubles in there with <gasps> the lights. Ooh. Yeah. I mean, this will be for sale, maybe. 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 It will be for sale, maybe. maybe. So I, that, I thought that was my last piece, but then Dave just handed Jessica an, uh, another piece of um, another item. This is Ainsley. And uh, we see a lot of Ainsley here in England. We do. However, this isn't a pattern that we see the most. And I've never seen it that big. No. I always Normally see really we see tiny little bits. things. This one's called Little Sweetheart Bone China, made in little England. Sweetheart. So. So, yeah. Know. And I always see, like, tiny things in Ainsley, like little trinket boxes or little, like. Yeah, little tiny, I'm, like, bud vases. I've never seen anything that big. Ainsley. I mean, I have, haven't they looked. They have it. We just don't always come across it. Yeah. I haven't looked for it, so it probably does exist. But I'm just yeah. saying that that's pretty. I just think it's a pretty. It is. Pretty vase. 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 Getting fancy now. Well, if you say vase here, they just lose their mind. They're like, oh. it's a vase. I'm like, okay. They're like, don't you mean vase? No, I mean vase. <laughs> I said vase. <laughs> I mean receptacle that holds the flowers. That's what I mean. <laughs> So fancy things. So, yeah, it's a fancy thing. So that all that and more was thirty pounds. And I thought that was kind of a bargain. I definitely. Did. I, was I think there. it was a better bargain than we thought from. Oh, girl, beginning. yeah, because I thought, okay, let's say I get two or three things out of it. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm okay, you know. And then, but there was so much more, and it kept going, and it kept going, and it kept going. I was like, oh my god, it's so much. And I was very lucky to find it because I'm not on Facebook at all. So for her to send that to me, that was so good. Because I've never seen oh, it. Oh, that's what friends are for. And yeah, I, yeah, and I had never seen it because I'm not on Facebook. So, and if you are resellers here in the UK, and, you know, it's hard right now because we're not going anywhere, nothing's open, and you think, mm, well, Facebook, y'all go look. If you're on Facebook, go look. Because, child, yeah. that was a bargain. I mean, you got to scroll through a bunch mm. of garbage or overpriced yeah. stuff. However... But you'll find, if you find that one gem, go for it. Just, Makes it worth it. And this was a chance I took. I didn't know how any of this would look. It could have been all chipped up for all I knew and be like, well, you know, you take an after charity shop when they open up. But none of this, I mean, there was like three things that I would take to charity shop afterward. And they were like stuff like, you know, like ice trays. Oh, <laughs> you know, yeah. Like little ice mm -hmm. things. Yeah, I can resell those. Um, I mean, some people will, but I, I just, it's not my wheelhouse. So. There's even like brand new bottles of shampoo. Yeah, there were. There were travel size bottles of shampoo. I mean, a yeah, lot. Yeah, even the big ones. Like yeah, the there was the big ones, yeah. Uses. Yeah. So, and you know, there was books and, oh, Christmas tree. Well, oh, not a Christmas yeah. tree, but it was like a... Like a light up. Like a light up tree, which I'm keeping for myself because it's so tacky. <laughs> <laughs> it just screams <laughs> me. It has a little birdie in it. And then, oh, yeah, on top I got a bird, so a little fake bird. So, there, that was really cute. Well, that's my haul, y'all. I'm so glad you stopped by. Remember... Subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, and comment. Let me know what your favorite piece of this haul was, or let me know if you've been able to find a bargain during these difficult times, because I'd really like to hear about it. And don't forget to subscribe to Thrifty Shutterbug, Jessica. Oh, thank you. Yeah, and follow me on Instagram at Damn Jewelry UK, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.